हेलो स्टूडेंट्स यू आर वेलकम इन एस जे सी क्लासेस ई लर्निंग प्लीज सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल फॉर बेटर लर्निंग टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट चेंजेस इन्वॉल्विंग एनर्जी मीन्स ड्यूरिंग अ चेंज every time energy changes means any process can absorb energy or release the energy during the process during a change energy is generally evolved or absorbed in the form of heat light sound or any other form means during the process any change just like of water to uh, ice energy is uh, released and ice to water energy is absorbed means during a change energy is generally evolved or absorbed in the form of heat light sound or any other form energy change may take place when there is a physical change but these changes are generally smaller than the energy changes that take place during a chemical change means the changes of energy in a physical change are smaller than the energy change take place in a chemical change what are physical changes we have already discussed what are physical changes and what are chemical changes when only state is changed up but composition remains same are known as physical changes but during the change composition is also changed up composition is also changed up are known as chemical changes are known as chemical changes clear those changes in which state may be changed up but composition remains same are physical changes then these kind of, in these kind of changes a small amount of energy changed is evolved but during a chemical change but during a chemical change a large amount of energy change is evolved or absorbed means change involving energy any change in a nature when any change occur it it this change involve energy also or always during a change energy is generally evolved or absorbed when energy is evolved when energy is evolved the processes are known as when energy is evolved the processes are known as exothermic process when energy is evolved then processes are known as exothermic process and when energy is absorbed then processes are known as endothermic process exothermic process or exothermic reactions what are exothermic those reactions in which energy is evolved those processes in which energy is evolved are known as exothermic processes just like of when liquid state of water 
is converted into the solid water means ice it is cooled out it is cooled out and in this process energy is evolved and in this process energy is evolved are known as exothermic processes are known as exothermic processes those processes in which energy is evolved means during a change energy is released are known as exothermic processes clear exothermic processes exo means exit thermic matlab tham heat when heat is evolved or existed is known as exothermic processes just like of when quick lime cao quick lime is dissolved in water it produces caoh ka hold twice slaked lime cao is known as quick lime and caoh ka hold twice is known as slaked lime quick lime means that lime which has a maximum amount of energy or internal energy and when it dissolved in water its energy is released it produces lime water or slaked lime and produces a lot of amount of energy are known as exothermic processes are known as exothermic processes now we are going to discuss about endothermic processes endo means absorbed thermic heat when heat is absorbed during any change are known as endothermic processes just like of solid form of ice is heated then it converted into liquid form of water means energy is absorbed during the process energy is absorbed means as to a solid absorb the energy and it gives liquid state of water are known as endothermic processes exothermic processes and endothermic process in some processes energy is evolved are known as exothermic and in some process energy is absorbed are known as exothermic processes are known as exothermic processes during a change energy is generally evolved or absorbed in which form heat light sound or any form energy change may take place when there is a physical change but these changes are generally smaller in physical and physical changes energy change are smaller while in chemical changes energy change are greater energy changes in a physical change so far you have learned that in a physical change two types of processes occur most often one of the process is change of state and the other is the dissolving of a substance in the liquid one is the change in the state of matter and second one is dissol dissolution of any substance in the liquid state both these processes involve energy changes mainly a change in heat energy mainly there is change of heat energy in both process solid to liquid uh, means uh, state change and another one is dissolution in both changes energy is always changed this is because in a change of state from solid to liquid or from liquid to gas 
the intermolecular force of attraction between the molecules has to be decreased means when state of matter is changed intermolecular forces also changed they may increase or decrease has to be decreased so that the intermolecular space increases this is possible only when solid or the liquid absorbs some heat energy when energy is absorbed then when energy is absorbed then kinetic energy of molecules is increased and in so they move very fastly this is possible only when the solid or the liquid absorbs the some amount of heat or energy for example ice while mel melting absorbs heat energy and water while boiling also absorb heat energy means when you move from solid to liquid or liquid to gas you always give energy to the system means this is endothermic processes these are endothermic processes similarly in the change of state from liquid to solid means intermolecular forces are increasing and intermolecular spaces are decreasing or from gas to liquid the intermolecular force of attraction between the molecules intermolecular force is increasing because molecules are coming so closer force of attraction between the molecules has to be increased so that the intermolecular space decreases then intermolecular space decreases and forces increases when forces increase energy is always released energy is always released this can happen when the liquid or the gas releases some heat energy a very little amount of energy is absorbed or released for example water while freezing releases heat energy and water vapor while condensing releases heat energy the absorption or evolution of heat energy is also observed when a substance is dissolved in a liquid when any substance dissolve in a liquid it may be exothermic or be the endothermic just like of when sugar is dissolved in water when sugar is dissolved up in water it absorbs energy as you increase the temperature solubility increases it means it is an endothermic process and when you dissolve calcium hydroxide or slaked lime in water it is an exothermic process means it releases energy means when any substance is dissolved up they may also show exothermic change or endothermic changes means in any kind of change always energy is absorbed or released in any kind of change energy is always absorbed or released means in any kind of change always there is a change of energy it may be endothermic or exothermic in physical changes mainly change of energy is in the form of only heat during a physical change mainly the energy change is in the form of heat energy changes in a chemical change in a chemical change of substances the molecules and atoms of the substances rearrange themselves to form new substances what are chemical changes when a when a substance changes into a new substance when a substance changes into a new substance are known as chemical changes are known as chemical changes in a chemical change of substance the molecules and atoms of the substance rearrange themselves to form new substance means the composition is changed up completely this rearrangement involves some energy changes energy is released in some chemical changes while in others it is absorbed energy is released in in some chemical changes energy is released when energy is released in some kind of chemical changes are exothermic while in others it is absorbed while in others it is absorbed it means it is endothermic which involve the burning of a substance which involve the burning of the substance energy in the form of heat and light is released in chemical changes energy in the form of heat energy 
in the form of heat and light is released in chemical in chemical changes energy is always released in the form of heat while in physical changes released in form of only heat energy in the form of heat and light is released in chemical changes which involves the burning of substance energy in the form of sunlight is absorbed or in the form of heat is absorbed in the process of photosynthesis when photosynthesis process occurs it absorbs sunlight it begin it being a chemical change energy in the form of heat is released when water is added to quick lime or chemical during a chemical change energy change in is uh, energy change is in the form of heat light or sound heat light or sound in some cases also energy is released in form of sound are known as chemical changes in this way we ended chapter number 2 physical and chemical change okay students now we are going to disclosing this topic for today in next video we will further discuss about further topics of this chapter i think you enjoyed this video